So, Capricorn, this new moon <clears throat> cycle might bring a lot of focus into your existent and past problems. So the nature of your problems, existing and previous ones, seem to be all kind of brought here to the surface. There might be circumstances that you felt or believed you were, you know, done with or free from, and then they come back kind, kind of um, to test you or haunt you or prove you that, nope, they were not yet resolved, they were not yet done. Something was that you believed were done is not done with you. So it's like a problem or a very challenging aspect or situation that has been... You know, it's like pushed to, to push to the back. It's like, I feel like some of you have been delaying, dealing with whatever this is. And now the time has come, like the time for reckoning, the time to take care of situations that you didn't want to deal with because you know it's going to be complicated or it's just going to upset you or upset the balance of how things are. Some of you are very concerned with this upset um upsetting of the scales, right, of balance. You want your life to keep being steady or balanced or set in the ways that currently they are. And something might disrupt the balance. And I do feel like for some of you, it's problems in work or your professional front. For others of you, it could also be relationships. But I feel heavily professionally, there's a professional atmosphere here that might be um, complicated, again, I just keep getting complicated, complex, difficult, challenging. Not for all of you, of course, but it might be that either there's a lot of pressure and a lot of mistakes, you know, especially for Capricorns that are working for others. Um, you might, you know, have to make tough, um, calls and decisions and, um, even for some of you, it's like you're being blamed for things you didn't do or that they were not your responsibility. Some of you don't have the best relationships as well with superiors or people you are working with. So there's a harmony, the harmony in, um, in your work environment seems to not be the best. It could also be that there's just disagreements in general with how you want things to do, I'm sorry, how you want things to go, how you want to do things, your, your professional performance versus what you're being pressured, what, what the type of performance you're being pressured to, to, to do and to make out there, the role. Um, some of you, it's matters of, again, justice, uh, morals. Um, it's like, it might be that you have to lie for something or you have to deceive a situation to get a good outcome and you don't feel okay with it or you know someone is telling you to do something that you just plainly disagree for either moral ethical reasons and there might be some issues um with that i also feel like there's just a general sense of things being aggravated, you know, it's like um, there has been some denial on your side, I feel, to look at problems. I keep getting that you just didn't want to be bothered with it. You know it's going to be intense, or if part of you knew it's going to be intense, it's going to push you a lot, your, t your temper or your emotional, again, well-being is going to be put on the line as well, your stress levels, and so you have been delaying it, but... Something might be like, uh, you know, the, the bubble is going to be here popped and you will have to look at how things are. For some of you, it's also about family dynamics and crisis. Like, I feel like there's a lot of blame and pointing fingers. So perhaps you have been absent or more absent from the family setting here. And you might start to feel like your partner does not get you, your children do not get you, not feeling like some of your closest ones understand what you're doing. Um, it could be that you realize that there are people that are much more 
you know, hurt or, you know, emotionally, you know, it's like emotionally not looking at you in the best lens. And you might be surprised with it. So like something you didn't expect, like for someone that you care about to have all those harsh feelings towards you or the other way around. It could be that, you know, you're, you're having trouble um, feeling emotionally connected with people that you're meant to be emotionally connected. So again, there's all, all that pressure of feeling like this is my kid or this is my my parent, this is my spouse, I should be emotionally available and connected, but something in me just can't. Some of you are here to make some type of evaluation um, of some internal issues you have as well. It's time to just, I feel like it's time to just look at the truth. How things are with no, you know, sugar coating or denial of, some, of any sort so you can then by looking at something that be, in the beginning will be hard to look you will then confront the situation and then you will be able to see what you can do to fix it to solve it to heal it so i hope you have a great new moon cycle if you would like to have a personal reading with me please contact me through the email I put in the description box below for the month of May as usual I have a special tarot offer available at a sales price and for this month it's called sensations if you would like to know more details about this special offer or any other of my services just email me or if you would like to donate and support my channel you can also do so by following the PayPal link which is also down below